All right, y'all, what's going on? What's going on? All right, so today I'm eating some boneless chicken wings and fries. Okay, so if you're new to the channel, please, please, please subscribe to the channel. Please subscribe. Even if you aren't, if you haven't subscribed, definitely go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell so you get notifications the next time we post a video. Leave us some comments down below. Let us know things you like to see us try, things you like to see us cook, interact with us, because we'd like to hear from you. I'm going to say grace and get started. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for this food that we're about to receive for nourishment of our bodies and health. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So, my phone is upstairs a while. I'll give y'all a little close up. But we had wings and fries yesterday for football. And so I am eating leftovers. Um, we got, now we were supposed to have bone in wings, but my sister messed up the church's money and ordered, accidentally ordered boneless wings. So, but listen, I was fine. It was cool with me, it was cool, and I was hungry. Uh, we had salad. She also had sushi there. <laughs> That's all right. You heard five things. This food. I'm about to receive for nourishment of my bodies and health. And Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I don't know what I'll be forgetting. I don't know. Let me get my wing out of here. I don't necessarily want my wing in the uh, kitchen. Well. You got it from a place called Roosters, which I've had. I've eaten Roosters on the channel. The one vlog I did with my cousins it was like a football Sunday football vlog. We had I had Roosters that day. That's the restaurant we were sitting in, and um, then I just eating Roosters solo. I had wings and pizza. Cause I had really wanted pizza that day. Um, I am drinking on this. Um, so Minute Maid has these zero sugar drinks, lemonades, and punt. This one is a mango passion. Uh, can is it go focus? It's probably really bright. But I heard my keto friends when they was on keto, the co friends, um, they raved about this juice or whatever, and it was keto friendly. And so when I tasted it, I'm like. I would taste stuff like that they would talk about that they was eating. I would try it just to see, you know. I wasn't doing keto, but I wanted to just, you know, see what they was eating. I got this juice. I didn't know what to expect. But when I tell y'all, it was so good. It don't taste like it ain't no sugar in there. It tastes like regular Minute Maid drink. So, we get the fruit punch all the time. And the couple times that the when Calvin is in the video, since I know he kind of still, you know, watching that stuff, I'll get um, that, the, the fruit punch. But listen, I drink it too, because it's good. And I happen to be in a store... Cause he was telling me that they had new flavor. And I want to say he said it was only in Meyer. And I, when I was Instacarting in Meyer yesterday, I just happened to look, turn around from the aisle I was in and saw it. I was like, oh, I'm getting this. I don't even care. Because usually when I'm in the grocery store, I just like to focus on whatever order I'm doing. I usually won't buy stuff for me. But. I don't do it that day. I don't know if I say I'm eating my jalapeno ranch. I got regular ketchup today. I should grab one of the jars of ranch she had over there. Oh, um, I have mild wings or nuggets. They were calling them nuggets yesterday. I have mild nuggets, Carolina Gold, which is like their best flavor, in my opinion. And barbecue, but I don't know if I put a barbecue one on here. Mm. 
And y'all gonna see videos of leftovers, cause let's call it leftover week. <laughs> cause I got meatloaf to eat. Um, crab legs to finish. Um, yeah, I see that. I got that leftover Domino's piece. I will eat it, but I don't think I fully um, ad not ad or advised in that video that it was just trash. It was trash. I didn't like it. I realized that I don't like their sauce anymore. And I'm not really even a picky, like, You know, pizza kind of sore or anything, but I don't know. It just wasn't hitting on nothing. Even though it was fresh out the oven. I mean, I'm going to eat it because I spent my money on, you know, I'm going to stick beside it. But I just probably to live by why I don't drink, why I don't eat pizza. It was just not good at it. And I thought about this. Well, I guess because I really didn't have the thought while I was eating it. I also was hungry. But afterwards, I was just like, mm, that wasn't good when I look back on it. Woo! What are you doing? Yeah. I got your frying pan. You just ate. And Bubby is about to be too, y'all. Yeah, yeah. I have to keep saying it because I just can't believe it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Also, yeah. I'm so pissed yeah, because yeah. my lens for my camera is broke. Aww. It won't retract. So I can zoom in and zoom out. Uh, uh, um, I know it happened with the many times that my camera has been knocked off my table. I won't bring it, blame it all on the children, but I will say it's about probably 75% they fault. I did plan on getting like a new lens anyway, but like I'm not ready to spend new lens money because I want to get like a really good one. I'm gonna see how much the one that I already have on there costs. <laughs> My goal be to have YouTube pay for all the stuff I my all of my YouTube needs. But in order to do that, y'all gotta subscribe. If you're watching and haven't already subscribed and share it with a friend, share it with a friend. You know, more subscribers equals more views, more people watching the video, the more ad revenue you could potentially receive. And that's it. What are you doing? Doing. What are you doing? Are you not why are you not watching Puppy Doll Pals? Um, but I don't know it'll get there one day. I'm patient. <laughs> Plus, I honestly I truly do enjoy doing YouTube. I really do, so.
That's kind of reminiscent of that mango punch, man. The the regular mango punch. <laughs> that is good, because you know, if y'all don't know, that mango punch is my jam. It just don't taste like it don't got sugar in it to me. I don't read the lab like you know what all. Wait, what? Oh, mango puree from Concentrate and passion fruit juice from Concentrate. Those add a negligible amount of sugar, but not enough sugar to say that it has sugar in it. Purified water, lemon juice from Concentrate. Oh, lemon juice from Concentrate also adds sugar. Less than 0.5% of apple puree from Concentrate, which also will add sugar. Natural flavors, citric acid provides tartness. Vitamin C ascorbic acid, potassium citrate re uh, regulates tartness, aspartame, um, asper what's it called, aspartame, aspartame, esuphane, asuphane, potassium, beta carotene for color, and some of those adds a negligible amount. Oh, this is from Coca-Cola. I don't think I knew that Minute Maid was a Coca-Cola thing, did I? Excuse me. And it's pasteurized. Keep refrigerated shake well. Do not reuse. Please recycle. I will. Um. Huh? Oh, man, I'm going to tell y'all some more stories about Instacart, or a story about Instacart, because, yep, I haven't told y'all. So, I Instacart usually on Sundays, because Sunday is the most lucrative day for Instacart. Saturday, Sunday, Monday, but Sunday is a day. If you was like Instacart, if you had the time, if I had the time, well, I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it um, this coming Sunday because I won't have the bugs all day. So, no, I'm lying. He'd come back Sunday night. Well, even still, I'm going to get up early on Sunday morning and I'm going to go uh, Instacart. And I'm going to try to, I'm going to Instacart all day. Bet you I probably could make over two hundred dollars, like that's how lucrative it is, and especially um, like me, I try to be very, very conservative. Now, now that I got a hang of things and know the ropes, I um, I'm not big. They are different sizes or whatever. I like try to pick, be conservative about where I go. Like I don't be like the first couple times I did it, I kind of had myself all over the city. Like I basically was just accepting orders anywhere if, if they was a good dollar amount, but it just takes me far. It takes me a while to get there. Like you're doing more driving. Then you're actually shopping and making money. So now I got a couple stores that I will go to. I had asked somebody to look at something. I was like bumping my head about something at work. Um, 
I mean, let me have somebody I know for some things. All right, so what was I talking about? Yeah, I'm just like going, I was just all over the place. So now, like I said, I do, it's about four crowers right around me that I'll do. One day I want to try, um, yeah, so it's about four crowers that I go to. Or it's about two Myers that I'll shop at. No, let me say about five crowers. So this is two directly near me there's another one that's a little bit further away and then another one that's over by where my brother lives at i'll do that one um and then two myers one of them being the one that trick w kept having me delivered to that's how i told y'all i knew what the address to that Meyer was uh which by the way i have not i have been still door dashing and haven't like hey stop i haven't gotten an order for that name again um so yeah i got a game plan now and i feel like i'm getting faster at shopping orders especially um and even having multiple orders or whatever what really helps is if gavin pushed the cart and then you know and i could just keep i can move when he there but, um, yeah. Nanny, boo-boo. You boo-boo? You boo-boo? What? I got fries. Get down. I got fries. Here. Do you want to fry something? He literally just had fries and nuggets. So, yeah. I'm gonna try it. If I remember, I'll report, report back and tell y'all if I made it on Sunday or not. I think I did not. There are actually is some unnecessary code in there, but it's not hurting anything. Gotcha. <laughs> what am I gonna tell y'all something that I keep getting sidetracked? I was about to tell y'all a dang old story about Mr. Carter. Oh, so when I was doing Mr. Carter on Sunday, that's so crazy. I done went into a whole tangent when the whole time I was supposed to tell y'all this story I'm about to tell y'all, which ain't really a whole story, but I was delivering groceries to this apartment complex. Also, if you're squeamish, it was not real bad, but anywho, I was delivering groceries I've been to this place before, I feel I've been to this address before, but anywho, as I'm going up to the place that I need to deliver it to, I saw a freaking dead mouse on the ground, y'all, like in front of the, luckily, you cannot, you cannot play with that. It was a, a dead mouse on the ground. Uh, so I took a picture of it and sent it to see it. And my, why my brother gonna say why you? He said why you killed Jerry, man. I said, man, somebody got the Jerry before I got there. I ain't even touch it. Yay! I'm just so glad that. Well, it's unfortunate that Jerry had to go the way he did. I actually don't know how he went. The fact that Jerry was still out there was disgusting. Like, right? I'm glad I don't live in that apartment complex. I knew people that lived there though. Um, and refresh my memory on the state company I'm supposed to be. You said. What are you doing? Just eat out of there. I don't even know if that was even editable. Editable. 
Edible. 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 Yeah, so that was crazy. Also, when I was door dashing one time, I uh, I seen uh, somebody had little roaches crawling on their um on their thing, and I'm like, Lord, just please don't let me have brought any of them. They got in my, on my shoe and nothing. So listen, I I live with roaches before. I don't need to do it again. Okay. Guys. Guys. All gone. All gone. Ain't nothing there. It's gone. All gone. It's gone. All gone. Yeah, he gone. He's like. All gone. Okay, get down. <laughs> get down. Get down. You want pop pop? Grayson, get down. Get down. Get down. Uh, help me, y'all. Happy. Yeah. I hear her knocking. What? Um, Bobby. yeah, show nothing. I'm like, mm, I had to sit their food down on their porch. They better not try to say nothing about me because y'all knew y'all had them roaches and y'all said leave it at the door. One no table, nothing for me to put it on, so I had to leave it where the roaches was at. I mean, it was only one. Oh, let me stop exaggerating. It was only one, but still. And yes, I'm positive it's a roach. I'd have seen enough in my lifetime to know what one looks like. This absolutely tastes like mango punch. And it absolutely does not taste like it don't have uh, sugar in it. They trying to just, I think they just saying that they didn't add no sugar in it. That's it. And it says 3% juice. That's it. Mmm. All right, y'all. Well, I'm about to piece of pie here. That's it. And that's all, y'all. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Yeah. Leave some comments down below. That's some things you like to see us try. Things you like to see us cook. Interact with us because we do like to hear from you. And subscribe to the channel. Go ahead and subscribe. And hit that bell so you get notifications the next time we post a video. We'll see you in the next one.